Subscribe our channel for latest news updates. Obama DOJ official admits free-flowing relationship with Trump dossier author. A top Obama official admitted the DOJ had regular contact with Steele. A top State Department official who served under former President Barack Obama's administration admitted he shared more than 100 documents from Christopher Steele, including his unverified dossier. In a Washington Post column published Thursday, Jonathan Weiner admitted he had a free-flowing relationship with Steele, and that he gave his anti-Trump dossier to top Obama officials at the State Department. Weiner, a top ally to former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton, wrote that he had shared more than 100 of Steele's reports with the Russia experts at the State Department over a period of two years. Weiner said he shared additional Trump-related information with State Department officials that was given to him by a Clinton contact. Steele was feeding anti-Trump information to Clinton, who would then have her ally Cody Shearer pass it along to Weiner at the State Department. Congressional records show Clinton used Shearer to do her dirty work, where he not only helped Steele write his dossier, but he also passed it to Weiner at the State Department and to officials at the FBI. That is collusion. But more importantly, this corrupt scheme led by Clinton allies triggered the entire Russia investigation. But it goes much deeper. Steele was hired by Fusion GPS and other Clinton-connected group to compile the dossier. Shearer worked closely with Steele to compile the dossier, which is full of numerous unverified claims that are aimed at harming Trump. The Steele dossier literally claims Trump had Russian prostitutes urinate on him during trips to Moscow. Not on top of that, Clinton's 2016 campaign and the Democratic National Committee gave nearly $10 million to fund the dossier. None of that mattered to the deep state actors determined to derail Trump at all costs. Weiner wrote that the dossier was taken from the Obama-era State Department officials and given to the FBI. The FBI then used the dossier to obtain the warrant from the Foreign Intelligence Surveillance Court to spy on Trump's 2016 campaign. How's that for collusion? Weiner has admitted Clinton's team paid for the dossier, funneled information to Steele to include in the document and then passed it along to her allies in the State Department and FBI to start the Russia witch hunt. Many would agree all of these corrupt actors should be charged criminally and thrown in jail for this massive corruption scheme. 